Hello guys, I'm Shlok and you're watching TechBurner. In this video, I will show you how you can get the pixel navbar with the animation, the long press animation and the home button animation on your Android phone. So let's start. So for this to work, you will require root access of course and you will require Expose Framework pre-installed. If you don't know what Exposed is or you want to know how to install Exposed Framework, you can click the icon in the top right corner. It would be an eye icon and that will show you how to install Exposed on your phone. After you're done installing Exposed Framework and enabling it, you have to open the Play Store and then type in Pixel Navigation Bar. When you type that, you will get an Exposed module. I will also leave a link in the description so that it's easy for you to find. So this is the module that will help you to install the Pixel Navbar on your phone. This is a fairly new module. It only has about a thousand downloads, but it works. So yeah, just go ahead and install it. So after you have installed the app, you will get a notification that this module is not enabled in the exposed framework. You can open the module and see it for yourself, but you'll have to enable it in the exposed framework for it to work. So you have to open exposed framework again and then go to the module section by swiping from the left and clicking the modules button. And then you'll have to enable the pixel navigation bar. There would be a small tick in the right corner. After you enable the exposed module, you'll have to reboot your phone. So I'll just reboot it quickly. And voila, now you have the pixel navbar with all the animations in it. You have the long press animation and the home button press animation. So click the subscribe button if you like the pixel navbar and let me know in the comment section how it is. So yeah, if you uh, open the pixel navbar, you can change the settings for it. You can enable the long press animation or the home button animation and that's kind of it you if you don't like it you can disable it and uninstall the app i previously made an android oreo boot animation concept and i'm planning to do an easter egg for that so if you want some more content like that you can subscribe to this channel and you can also watch some previous videos of mine you might like the video that helps you get pixel interface on your phone